what's up people and welcome to another video of uh, the android dude reviews today i'm gonna show you how to uh, firstly uh, protect yourself before you flash a rom and then after we're gonna flash a rom and this uh, rom is our update from uh, xnode 5.1 to 6.0 that got released i think four days ago or something and uh, this update uh, called xnode 6.0 got a lot of new things that i want to check out like they got six or seven new grids for for the x transformer and and a lot of things that he has uh, changed uh, in the update so let's begin guys we're gonna start up our mobile or our device and then we're gonna hit restart and then we're gonna go to recovery and do our backup I know that many people already knows how to uh, do backups and how to protect yourself and things like this I only do this to to show maybe we have some new people that that are watching and don't know or uh, yeah you never know some people skip this part but I don't because I I want to play it safe so why, why? I mean this device is so expensive so uh, yeah it's better to be on the safe side than on the bad side so yeah okay let's hit back up and as you can see i back up everything this is something uh, everyone can choose if they want to do or not you don't have to back up everything it's not necessary you can back up your system your data and your recovery and boot or if you want you can add your EFS and modem and uh, but I back up everything that's that's what I do and I never ever had any problems whatsoever so let's swipe and here we go now it's backing up the system so I'm gonna pause uh, the video and I'm gonna be back when uh, this is done and we're gonna go from there see you in a bit folks and welcome back guys as you can see everything went smooth uh, the system and everything is backed up uh, you can see uh, in the green text I I don't know if you can see very, very well but it says just and perfect so we're gonna hit back here we're gonna hit back here and we're gonna go to wipe and we're gonna wipe we're gonna do a factory reset and that's all you need to do for this ROM and I also know this uh, 6.0 and 5.1 also can be flashed on two more uh, devices I just can't remember which ones uh, but you can check that on the XDA forum so it's no problems but anyways let's uh, factory reset here we go the factory reset is done let's hit back back and then we go to install and I got a lot of stuff here let's see if we can find oops oh, come on what's wrong here we go so here we got it I don't know if you can see very well even though I keep it near or far it doesn't matter but anyways it's the X-Note Aroma Build 6.0 uh, 
and with the firmware MK, MK2 public so we're gonna hit this one and just to double check uh, that this is the ROM you're flashing you, you can read it again up here where I keep my finger it says Xnote Aroma Build 6.0 MK2 public.zip so this is the one we're gonna flash so let's go let's flash happy flashing X node I'm gonna pause the video again and do this uh, uh, wizard the aroma wizard and after I have done this and the phone is boot booted up I will come back so see you in a while guys so welcome back guys as you can see it's installing now uh, I saw he has added a few new things to aroma you can choose if you want to have your clock in center or you want to have it uh, yeah where you want to have it with different uh, angles and things like this uh, it's a little bit hard to explain but uh, if you choose to uh, flash this ROM you will see for yourself in Aroma Installer uh, I did choose uh, the Viper 4 sound uh, boost or whatever you call it I have always gone with the uh, uh, stock audio but for this one I'm gonna try uh, Wiper 4 so as you can see the install is done uh, the ker uh, kernel I did choose the the normal one that is MK2 I don't want to play around with another kernel so let's hit next and reboot device So now we wait. Ah, cool. He has added a new, uh, yeah, what do you say? A new uh, boot screen, yeah, boot screen. Before it was the Easter egg, but this one is more, much more beautiful. I don't know if you can see the different colors, but it's blue, red, green yellow yeah, it's beautiful and by the way I'm recording with my note 10.1 so uh, just to let you guys know what I'm using uh, for rec for my recorder and in the background you can see what devices I own uh, I got my Galaxy Note 10.1, my Nexus, my Note 2, and my Note 3. So those those are the devices I'm working with mostly. Every single one is rooted and running its own ROMs. And for the Nexus, there is a toolkit that is wonderful. I have to check on my computer what the name is. One moment. Uh, it's the Nexus Root Toolkit. For anyone who owns a Nexus 7, use this toolkit. It's wonderful. It's very, very, very easy to use. Even a child could uh, root and unroot. Uh, your Nexus 7 with that toolkit because the toolkit does everything for you you only choose uh, what you want to do and boom you go this can take some time as you know but 
usually if you come this far you are safe you you gonna boot boot up to the wizard here we go i can feel the vibration so i gonna pause the video again i gonna enter everything and after i will uh, come back again so just a moment guys welcome back guys as you can see it's running beautifully everything went fine and as you can see I got the clock in the middle and also I got the uh, the kilobytes per second showing but I will remove that late later on so or maybe I will keep it it's pretty cool so uh, here you can see the three different uh, 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 windows you can choose you got the the KitKat one that's this one and you got the simple touch with one and you got the normal touch with uh, further down so let's go with the uh, KitKat one just to check it out so here you got got the Kit Kat uh, UI. As you can see, everything is working perfectly. And this is the UI for the Kit Kat one. And if you want to go back, you just hit your home key. And there you got your touch with uh, no more UI. But anyways, I'm gonna do a new uh, uh, review for the video, uh, a new video for this ROM after I, I have checked out everything. And when it's done, I will uh, post the video. So for now, I want to say thank you and see you in uh, the next review, the Android Dude Reviews. Bye-bye.